Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at the steps to uninstall Windows 11 version 22H2 to roll back to the previous installation, in this case version 21H2. If you upgraded to the latest version of Windows 11, it is possible to uninstall it to revert back to the previous version without losing your files, in the case that the new release is having problems with bugs or any other issues, or you just want to stay in the same version for a little longer. You can complete this task using the recovery settings. However, you only have the option for the first 10 days after the upgrade was completed. After this period, Windows 11 will delete the files from the previous installation. After uninstalling Windows 11 version 22H2, you may need to reinstall some apps and you will lose some of the settings that you may have configured while you were using the newer release. Okay, here is how to uninstall Windows 11 version 22H2. These instructions should also work if you upgrade it from any other version of Windows 10. First, open Start and look for Settings. And then open the app. Then click on System and open the Recovery page. Under the Recovery options, click the Go Back button. If the option is grayed out or is missing, it won't be able to roll back to the previous version of Windows 11. However, you can still perform a clean installation with the files from the older release to roll back to the previous version. On this page, select any of the reasons and click Next. We're going to skip the updates checking by clicking No Thanks. Also make sure to read the rolling back to the previous version you will need to reinstall some apps and you may lose changes applied after the upgrade. And then click Next. If your password is different from the one you had before, make sure to know the old password, otherwise you may lose access to your account. Now we're just going to click Next and then just click the Go Back to Earlier Bill button to start the process of rolling back. I don't need to remove the latest version of Windows 11 on this computer, so I'm just going to click Cancel. But that's exactly what you need to do to uninstall version 22H2 and go back to the previous installation, that being Windows 11 version 21H2 or if you upgraded from a supported version of Windows 10. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet, and I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.